Hey, what is up, guys? Welcome back to the world of AI. In today's video, I'm going to be covering Agent GPT, which is a new tool that enables users to configure and deploy autonomous AI agents on the web front. So you don't need to install anything locally on your computer. Whereas, I mean, you could, but this is something that is provided free on a server. So I highly recommend that you play around with this. It's completely free, which is amazing. So with that thought, let's get into the video. If you guys haven't subscribed, please do so. Comment and like whatever you guys want to see in the future. So with that thought, let's get into the video. So what is Agent GPT? As I said, it's an autonomous AI agent on the web source. With Agent GPT, you can name your own custom AI and define any goal that you want the agent to actually achieve, which is quite remarkable. Once the goal has been set, and when you tell the agent to actually achieve this goal, the agent will continuously use its intelligence to think of a task that needs to be done to reach this goal. And it will basically execute the task by learning from the results and adjust the strategies accordingly to achieve that initial objective. Now, one of the most impressive features is that Agent GPT is able to autonomously plan, execute, browse the web, and retrieve strategies to complete this task that you have. This means that you can actually give the agent a task and it will work on its own to actually complete it, which also, which basically means the autonomous function. For example, if you want the agent to write an article on a specific topic, which I'll show you, it will actually gather the information from various sources, generate ideas, and actually write the article itself. Now, the agent will learn from its mistakes and continuously improve its strategies to become more efficient and effective over time. Now, Agent GPT actually is using GPT 3.5 architecture, which is the state of the art language model developed by OpenAI. And this architecture also allows the agent to understand natural languages as well as generate responses that are coherent and relevant to what you're trying to achieve. Now, the agent will also can communicate with users through a variety of channels such as chat boxes emails and voice assistants which is something that you're trying to achieve now this is the roadmap that they're trying to achieve with agent gpt guys if you want to support it it's something great that they're trying to do and it's completely free i'll leave the link down in the description below for the github i believe you can install it on your local desktop so this is just a simple way instructions on how you can actually do so. But in my opinion, I think you should just use Agent GPT on the web front as it's so much easier. But there's one thing that you might need to do and that is providing a paid API key. You can't use the free one that OpenAI gives. You're gonna be needing something that is paid to actually provide to run this system with without any like hassles. So. You have to just create an account, pay for it, and you can paste it on their website. Once you have done that, you can click save. Obviously, I do not have it, so I'm not able to do it. But you can still run smaller prompts for free, which is amazing. So if you want to know the pricings per tokens, you can definitely check this website out on their page to understand how much you will need to actually achieve as well as run this platform. Now, first things first, you just need to name it World of AI, something that is relevant to your, your prompt. In this case, I'm going to say, do the example that I said before, which is making an article. So I'll say, write an article on how to grow your YouTube channel. And that's just, the, I'm going to just give it a prompt, a goal. And basically, you deploy an agent which will continuously work on the back end and it will start formulating different tasks that will be needed to actually achieve this goal as you can see here it, it added a task first in research successful strategies used by popular youtube creators to grow their channels this is one of the tasks that the agent has deployed oh it's going crazy right now <laughs> Second task was analyze current content and audience engagement of YouTube channels in question to identify areas of improvement. And the third task it generated was that generate a comprehensive and tailored plan for optimizing the YouTube channel's content presentation and promotional strategies. And basically from this, we're able to see that it, you give it an objective, it has three different goals and it executes on each 
different goal by sourcing it through different like information as well as data sets on the web to actually articulate as well as achieve the initial objective that you had reached it out to do and basically it will execute each of the tasks by doing these researches and you can get a better idea of where it formulates the tasks and it also even adds different tasks throughout the process as it keeps on continuously working on improving as well as getting the best response to achieve your uh, your overall objective and it's going to keep on doing this for a couple seconds it's very very detailed and very like in a way it can achieve anything that you wanted to achieve on a lower scale of prompts obviously it's in its beta phase right now so it's going to take some time until it can actually achieve greater concepts as well as greater like uh, basic objectives and as you can see here this because it's a demo and we're and it's agent can't run continuously you're gonna need to actually provide an api key for it to run continuously uh, i would highly recommend if you have a lot of tokens you should be able to do this and test around it because it's a really good agent that replicates auto gpt which we can see in my previous video and it it's exactly the same thing as auto gpt but on the web front so i highly recommend that you check it out guys as it's completely free and it's very resourceful so definitely check this out guys i hope you found this video entertaining as well as a lot of you were able to get some sort of value out of it i know i wasn't able to execute the task because I, I never provided an api but if you do have a paid api key i definitely recommend that you check it out and what you can also do is copy whatever tasks as well as basic like generative prompts that you have executed you can copy it and paste it onto your web front and that's just the gist of today's video guys i hope you found this video entertaining i'm gonna leave the links down in the description below if you want to check out some of my other videos please do so and please subscribe guys i'm always going to continuously provide you guys the best content and i'm going to continuously work and improving this channel so if you want to donate please do so in the description below i have a link a coffee link to do so so with that thought guys i'll see you guys next time have a great day and i'll catch you guys next time peace out fellas